So to the end, I would like to show you the important things you need to know about your Wi-Fi. We're talking about if you go on a trip, make sure that you check this before you go into the hotel or go into the public Wi-Fi when you going on the trip. Because I can tell you, even Thailand or Japan, there are some places the Wi-Fi is not secure. And I'm going to show it to you what you should what you should do before you actually connect to their Wi-Fi. If you haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do so because this is quite important to know how to do this. And let's get started. So when you actually connect to your Wi-Fi, make sure it's safe or not being hacked right so the only thing you have to do is you have to check your status so you're going into setting and you will actually see this part right here we're going to go to connection and we're going to go to wi-fi and here will show you if it's secure or not a lot of people will skip this step and at the end they will get hacked because the wi-fi is not secure so we're going to go into the wi-fi and then we're going to go to three dots once we go to three dot, you can see intelligent Wi-Fi. Once we go to intelligent Wi-Fi, make sure you scroll all the way down and the lab is on. If your lab is not on, you just need to keep tapping this until when the lab is tells you it's on. Okay, now we're gonna go in there. And you can see this is your status of your Wi-Fi. How many times your Wi-Fi was on, what type of connection you've been connecting, okay, gigahertz, Wi-Fi what, okay, Wi-Fi 6, Wi-Fi 5, or Wi-Fi 4, okay, and so on and so on. And here, you can actually inspect your home Wi-Fi as well too. So you can actually go in here and walk around your house and see where it has the best spot and where it doesn't have the best spot. You can check everything. Now, we are going to go into unsecured Wi-Fi. And right here tells you which Wi-Fi is not secure. And you can see even in Japan, Madonna, Lawson, okay, everything is not secure. Tokyo bus free Wi-Fi because I brought this to Japan this year. And you can see there's actually a few of them is not secure at all. So this is the reason why you should double check before you actually connect your Wi-Fi. Do you want to do your banking? Uh, stuff do you want to do your important stuff using those Wi-Fi because it happens to me when I connect to this Wi-Fi right here and then the next day my phone got hacked and and I'm not sure what's going on but it was my Facebook got hacked and my WhatsApp got hacked you can see right there it will show you when it's being created okay when it's being created and it will show you every every single detail and if they tell you it's not secure, prefer not to use them. Yes, it's going to be slower because Wi-Fi compared to your mobile data is a little bit slower, but it's more safer. If you want to upload any videos, it's going to be much slower. But you want to make sure this is not happening, okay? Do not connect any of those. Now let's go back to your home inspection Wi-Fi. You just press start, select whatever the Wi-Fi they're using right now. And then you can see the number already, 22, negative 27, or 34, which is much better, okay? This is higher. So negative 35 or 31, all the way to negative 70, those ones are not good. So make sure that you can see your bar, as long as you're at the top right there, it's much better. At the bottom here, you don't want to touch them because it's a very, very weak signal. All right, so going on the trip, make sure you check this every time when you go on a trip, every single hotel, and make sure you don't get hacked. Please subscribe my channel and share this video, and Merry Christmas and Happy Holiday. I will see you next time. Bye-bye. Peace out.